A question that's often asked when discussing Python is which version of Python should you be learning? On the python.org website, under downloads, you'll notice that both Python 3 as well as Python 2 are available. Now, Python 2.7 is the last release of Python 2. Python 2.8 will not be released. All development efforts are concentrated on Python 3. But notice you can still download Python 3 or Python 2.7. On the wiki.python.org website, there's a question. Should I use Python 2 or Python 3 for my development activity? And we told that Python 2.x is legacy, Python 3 is the present and future of the language. So again, the final release of Python 2 is version 2.7 with a statement of extended support for this end of life release. There will be no new major releases after 2.7. Python 3 is under active development and has already been around for a long time. Version 3.3 .3 was released in 2012, 3.4 in 2014, and so forth and so on. So that means that all recent standard library improvements are only available in version 3. That being said, however, a lot of network devices and a lot of operating systems have Python 2 as the default. So as an example, on my Mac, if I type Python, I have Python 2.7 by default. Python 3 is not installed by default on my Mac. And that's true for a lot of network devices as well. So which should you learn? I would suggest you learn both. What you'll notice is there aren't that many differences between the two languages. From our point of view, it's very easy to move from one language to the other. One of the big changes is print. Notice here, I can use print as follows without any brackets. But if I use Python 3 and try and print that way, I get an error. I need to use brackets because print is now a function. So I need to use brackets around my text that I want to print out. What you'll notice with the two languages is that they're very similar. There are some things that you need to be aware of. But notice that the most drastic improvement is better Unicode support. However, that may not affect you that much when doing network programmability. So the advice is learn both. In my Python courses, we'll use both. We'll use Python 2 as well as Python 3 for network automation. Be aware that some libraries require version 2, so they won't work with version 3, but it's good for you to learn both languages. It's probably gonna be easier to start with 2.7, Watch my YouTube videos if you want to get started. And then if you want to learn more, have a look at my Python paid courses, which go into more detail and teach you both the theoretical and practical applications of Python for network programmability. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like it and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.